Hello, this is Jill. Hey, many of you have the new Samsung Smart TVs, and these are great TVs. They have really good resolution. They have a lot of different app features that you can select from, and they're just overall really nice TVs. And one of these new features that these TVs can do is something that's called Samsung's Voice Assistant, or Bixby's Voice Command. And to access this feature, there's a little button on your remote that looks like a little microphone. And if you push that and speak in a command into your remote, your TV will do stuff for you. As an example, let me press this and say voodoo. Ready? Voodoo. There you go. It goes right to voodoo. Okay, so although this voice assistant is a really nice feature, some users have been having some issues. The little voice command, or the little icon that you see right here, kind of appears randomly when you're not even pressing the button. And it kind of interrupts the program you're watching. Now this could be really annoying, but I do have the solution for you today. Okay, what you need to do first is just take your remote and you want to press the home button, the, thing, the button that looks like a little house, and press that and you'll get to a menu on the bottom. And this is where most of your apps are located. So we want to move to the left until we hit settings. Select settings and then on the menu you want to go down to general, the little wrench right there, you hit general and in the menu you'll see Bixby voice settings. So we're going to select that and this will take you to the Bixby voice settings menu and you have a number of options, language, voice response. But the thing that's been causing so much issues is this, uh, this middle one, voice wake up. Now when you first get your TV, the voice wake up is typically set to on and to a sensitivity level of medium. Now this wake up feature has nothing to do with hitting the button on your remote. Unfortunately, the Bixby system is listening through your remote all the time to your voices. And if it hears sounds that it thinks is a command, it will sort of wake up thinking that you want some, it to do something and you'll get that little icon on your menu or your screen which interrupts your program. Now to resolve this issue, you could either do one of two things. You could lower the sensitivity that Bixby responds to, so it won't uh, respond to just medium sounds in the room. Uh, it will really take a higher, louder sound for Bixby to respond to it. You could also increase the sensitivity, uh, make it higher. Or you could turn off the wake up altogether, just by selecting off there. Now, by turning this off, it will not affect the voice assistant. You could still press the button on your remote and speak into your remote and, Bix and say a command and Bixie B will still respond to it. This, by turning this wake up off, it will just affect Bixby responding randomly to any sounds in your room. So let's go back and just, uh, just test this out. We'll just hit the button again and, and say voodoo. Voodoo. Maybe you didn't understand. Voodoo. There we go. And there you go. It goes right to Voodoo and so the voice assistant still works. Uh, so I hope this video helped you out and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.